Good morning. Today we're going to train the tomatoes up the cages, take the, some of the, some, nip some of the suckers off of them, and we're going to try floating homegrown eggs to see how fresh they are. Science. I'm working on my second cup. Let's do this. So you don't have to put fresh eggs in the fridge unless they've been in the fridge. I don't know why. My bachelor's of science is in education, not in science science. So a lot of my in-laws down in southern Louisiana, they put their mayonnaise that's been opened in the pantry. They don't put it in the fridge. And if you make the mistake of putting their mayo in the fridge, then they have to start keeping it in the fridge. I've never, I've never heard of that until, well, 20 years ago. But yeah, also some of them call mayonnaise mayonnaise. That's, it's, I'm sorry, no. So you know when you hard boil an egg and you can see there's a bubble on one end. Well, as an egg gets older, that bubble expands and gets larger. Now, farm fresh eggs, if they haven't been washed and they still have their natural coating or bloom, should last two weeks without refrigeration. These, uh, this is how we check for freshness. Uh, like, we, like I said, the bubble gets larger the older the egg is. So it starts to, if you submerge it in water, it starts to lift that end of the egg. And if, if it's all the way floating, that's a time bomb. It's just a matter of time, it's about to explode. Anyway, um, let's see if these lay on their side or if one will uh, pick up on one end, which means it's not terrible, it's just not the freshest. That one was gathered today, so I expected it to lay flat. Okay, not bad. This dude's laid around for a while, so I'm hoping we can tell the difference. I don't know if you can tell. One end is raised slightly. Come on. See that? Yeah, that one end is turning its nose up a little. So yeah, it does sound crazy, but uh, it's true. So I'm, um, you know, that's like some of y'all in 2020. There was a lot of turmoil, weirdness. There's things we didn't know, yet a lot of you showed your tail about stuff you didn't understand. Let that be a lesson to you. Oh, there's a lesson there somewhere. I had to bite my tongue so hard. It's a wonder I can still eat Nutty Buddies. Obviously, I still eat Nutty Buddies. I've waited long enough that now the cars are starting to move up and down the road. This is truly in the morning. The rooster tells it all. Anyway, um... Well, we did it. Um, we floated some eggs. But it wasn't perfect, but it's done. Thanks for coming. See you next time.
Life's what you make it. Let's get our hands dirty. <laughs>